In fact, it was the twin brother of the Japanese Mazda VT-50 pickup truck, differing only in exterior nuances and its own original coat. The benefits of Ranger for buyers in many countries were still obvious. The family car is also a commercial vehicle. Roomy body, 150 centimeters long x 130 millimeters wide. In this parameter, the pickup surpassed many of its classmates. Also in the cabin there are fastening loops for fixing the load, and a folding loading platform can withstand weights up to 100 kilograms. In addition, the pickup truck is ready to tow a trailer weighing up to 3.5 tons, and the total weight of the car and trailer can reach an incredible 6 tons. Other numbers are also impressive. 229 mm ground clearance and 80 cm fording depth. In Europe, the pickup truck was available with a 2.5-liter 143 horsepower common rail turbo diesel, a 5-speed manual gearbox, the automatic appeared only in 2009, and an all-wheel drive transmission with a plug-in front axle and a lowering row in the transfer case. A feature of the Ranger all-wheel drive transmission is the absence of a locking center differential. Its function is performed by the ESP system. Electronics stabilizes the pickup, automatically braking the necessary wheels, reduces torque and limits the speed through the engine control unit. Front suspension spring, independent, torsion bar, transverse wishbones. Rear suspension leaf spring with solid axle. Basically, there is nothing to brake. Among pickup trucks, the Ranger boasts enviable directional stability and a good balance between suspension stiffness and ride comfort. The salon is made of nondescript, but practical plastic. Contrary to expectations, the op did not rumble or creak, like many competitors. The details are generally perfectly fitted to each other, although outwardly, many complained about the nondescript rag interior in the basic versions, cheap plastic and lack of design. Even the leather seats on the wild track didn't make much of an impression, although, admittedly, there were more positive opinions. But the perfectly readable dashboard with large numbers, borrowed from the Mazda BT-50, was accepted by buyers with the bang, got better. And in general, the Japanese design, and the 5 was developed at Mazda, is associated with quality. The car as a whole came out durable and reliable, which is easy to read on the forums of its owners on the internet. However, there are some drawbacks that you should pay attention to when buying. The main enemy of a used car is corrosion, which can affect not only the body, but also the frame. The springs may squeak on the move. This is usually due to their contamination. The engine does not cause problems. His only whim is the need for frequent replacement of filters and oil. The manufacturer at one time even required to do something every 5,000 kilometers. Associated units are also devoid of source, such as a turbocharger or a dual mass flywheel. Trouble is more likely to be expected from the gearbox. On specimens before 2009, centering quickly, relatively quickly, burns. Ford in such cases usually recommended, in addition to the clutch, to change the flywheel, gears of the first and second gears. In terms of labor costs, the process is simple. The box is quickly removed and disassembled. In theory, you can save a little by leaving the old gears, and replace the clutch and dual mass flywheel with cheaper counterparts. It's fair that problems with the clutch and gearbox only arise if the pickup is subjected to excessive use. For example, it loads in excess of the prescribed ton or constantly tows heavy trailers. But, alas, the box has other ailments. Sometimes too large axial clearances on the shafts can cause fifth gear to be knocked out. In this case, it is also necessary to replace the gear. However, the manufacturer subsequently eliminated this sore. A similar problem is the transmission jumping out on the rise. The culprit is the external gear shift mechanism. Well, if knocks and screens are heard in the transfer case, then you will have to put up with the quick replacement of one of the transfer case guide bushings. Electrical problems are rare. When buying a car, you should look into the towing hook module under the rear light. Moisture can accumulate there. In a word, summarizing the past, you should not be afraid of a used Ford Ranger. The machine is made with a significant margin of safety. And if you are not afraid of some inconvenience on the second row sofa and a rather rough appearance, then you simply cannot find a better assistant on vacation and at work. Body. Corrosion is taken for the car, starting from the rear of the cab. He does not disdain chips and a frame, Ranger coloring is not his forte. With heavy use of a pickup truck as a truck, cases were recorded when the body met the cab. Some owners complain about the poor quality of chrome coatings and the surface of the side mirrors. Transmission. 
When using all-wheel drive and a reduced range of gears, there is an important nuance. In order not to lose the gearbox, we must not forget about the existence of a button to the left of the steering wheel that disables the electromagnetic clutches of the front axle, which turn on automatically when the 4WD mode is turned on. The scheme is not very comfortable. There are no such problems with the rear axle. A limited slip differential is installed there. Suspension. It is difficult to meet a car with a dead suspension on the market. In Russia, bricks are not transported on such machines. In front, more than 50,000 kilometers do not nurse the stabilizer struts. Shock absorbers live up to 100,000 kilometers. The rear axle beam is problematic to disable. But if every now and then conquer off-road, it makes sense to pay attention to the fact that water does not enter the bridge through the breather. And so, except for the stabilizer struts, which usually nurse up to 80,000 kilometers, there is nothing special to break here. Chassis. Front wheel bearings, 4,200 rubles, sometimes live up to 150,000 kilometers or even more, but there are cases of their replacement and after 40,000 kilometers injection, once every two years, require crosses, 5 PCS. Cardan shafts. Otherwise, the crosses, up to 3,500 rubles, will have to be changed. Engine. Air, 1,800 rubles, and fuel, 900 rubles, filters experts recommend changing every 10,000 kilometers. If this is not done, a loss of engine power will indicate the need for replacement. By 100,000 kilometers, crankshaft and camshaft oil seals may leak.